Don't die, bro. A little bit. Lakers coming through the tunnel with swagger. This looks like a team that's all. Good evening and welcome to tonight's presentation of Noche La NBA, an annual tradition in the NBA celebrating diversity and culture. And always a pleasure to bring it to you. This is Kevin Harlan, and beside me, Greg Anthony and Steve Smith. David Aldridge joins us on the sideline. Here we are, Smitty, right smack dab in the dog days of the season. How are the bodies feeling, you think, at this stage of the schedule? Kevin, if they tell you everyone's 100% healthy, that's just not true. Avoiding major injuries is huge for a team. But all players deal with aches and pains throughout the course of the season. Now a look at Philadelphia's starting lineup. Embiid is out there with MP. Then there's Tyrese Maxey. Then there's Buddy Heald, and it's Oubre in at the three seconds. Bangs home the trifecta. I like how sure of himself MP is at the arc. He acts like he already knows the shot is good. <laughs> Screened by Russell. The pass to James. Oh, Finish good. from three-point range. The matching baskets from the perimeter and earmark of today's game. Hey, players love competition, and the okay. fans love it as well. Okay. You know, Steve Austin Reeves has really won his way into the hearts and minds of these fans. They love him. Kevin, a classic breakout guy who hustled hard every chance he got and has continued to grow his game as he's earned opportunities on the floor. And that's a foul called on Kelly Oubre. That is his first foul of the game. First quarter of play with about a minute and a half gone. MP against James to the left side wing. Davis kicks to James. Five on the clock. The same GC and about the energy on D from MP making a clear difference on that end. Oubre finds MP. No Oubre way. sets the screen for MP. Another three for MP. Philadelphia. Wow, unconscious has he been this quarter. They're riding that hot hand. Here's James. It's hauled in by MP. Philadelphia's gone a perfect 4-4 four four from beyond the arc. A lot of their points coming by way of the three in the first quarter. There's a screen. Fires from deep. Good, another from three. And folks, three he just set the record for most three-pointers in a rookie campaign. Now, it hasn't been long since this record was last broken. I did not think we'd see it broken again this soon. Ever since entering the league just a few months ago, he has been on a mission to win. He's out there to ball. We've all seen it. Wouldn't surprise me, though, if he's unaware of the record. And MP is clearly among the best rookie shooters we've ever seen in the league. Well, we've heard the comparisons to Ray Allen, Clay, and Steph. And after seeing what MP's done this season, you start to believe he will be in that conversation. Now, here's MP. Coming off a solid outing against Phoenix. Back to MP. And they call the foul, so he's got the and one chance here to make it a three-point play. Well, this is as good as it gets for first quarter in terms of shooting the basketball. The 76ers shooting their first free throw of the game right now. And their success rate on the season, right around 77%. Now, here is Russell. We saw him with 19 points his last outing. Davis, the pass to Hachimura. The shot, no good. Great D that time from Oubre. Philadelphia leading by 11. Embiid the screen. MP kicks to Maxi. 
over Russell. That one a little long. And he's frustrated. That's a shot he can make in his sleep. Steve, wouldn't you agree the Los Angeles Lakers are one of, if not the most storied franchise in the NBA? Yes, Kevin, the facts prove it. The number one and number two all-time league scorers both captured the record as Lakers. That's history right there. No doubt he's struggling right now from the field. Let's see if he can get it going this quarter. Oubre, a screen on Hachimura. And here's MP for three. And even with good coverage defensively that time, he has confidence to drill the three. Russell sets a screen for James. And Embiid with the block. And how about the anticipation from the big fella? Embiid is one of the league's premier shot blockers. And here's MP for three. Rebounded by the Lakers. Davis has got his fourth rebound in this one. Guys are looking for a spark here. Yeah, a cold stretch offensively for sure. And here we go. MP heading to the hoop. They kick out to heel. Seven second difference. Shot and game clock. MP against LeBron. Oubre. And finished off by Oubre. Building up a big early lead. They have taken charge of this game. Play calling has been fantastic. They've been a step ahead of the defense since the opening tip. LeBron left shot. And he uses the glass on the way. LeBron's got seven points. A monster down low. LeBron James, the rare package of skill, size, and athleticism. MP has been leading the charge for this. Nine, the 76ers, 20. Substitution here for the Lakers. Anthony Davis is checked in for Vanderbilt. Achimura comes in for Torian Prince. Austin Reeves is checked in for Christie. And D'Angelo Russell subbed in for Dinwiddie. And Philadelphia will go for a different look here. Embiid, he's checked in for Paul Reed. Embiid comes in for Robert Covington. Oubre is checked in for Tobias Harris. And Heald subbed in for Kyle Lowry. Down in the block, it's LeBron and Davis. At the guard positions, Russell and Reeves. And Tachimura in at the three, the small forward. That's who's in the game for the Lakers. And talking about LeBron James, Steve, he still is on the hunt for more championships. Kevin, that hunger is still evident. He's all about finishing his career on a strong note, which includes winning as many titles as possible. And while we've got a moment, let's send it over to our terrific reporter, David Aldridge. David? Hey, guys. MP in the last time out against the Suns was superb. He finished with 19 points, and he was dominant at the offensive end with a high field goal percentage as well. And it was important for them to break that losing streak. He was a big reason why they were able to do it. Kevin? Thanks, David. He took command, and Greg really led the fight for his team. You like someone who's willing to take control. But, but then again, tonight could turn out to be a different story. Whether he's scoring, facilitating, getting the glass, his focus is just to provide whatever they need for the win. Well, we've seen that movie a few times, having an easy bucket in the paint. Embiid with a screen on James. MP kicks to heel. MP passes to Uber. Back to MP. Takes the three. Anthony Davis grabs the miss. Davis has got seven rebounds in the game. And after that great first quarter from three-point range, he has finally come back to earth. Pass to Reed. Hachimura with it. Pass to Davis. Shoots from the corner. It's hauled in by MP. Healed outside. Launches it from deep. Good, and it's MP picking up the assist. And the 76ers lead by 13. And so it's the Philadelphia 76ers. 13 points up at the end of the period. They've been playing some ferocious defense. And we'll be right back after this.
Chet Holcomb's basically positionless. He handles the ball. He shoots like a guard. He has the versatility of a forward. He's what, about seven. And now looking at our current game in progress, a disaster of a first half for the Lakers. Thanks for spending half. <laughs> I get Chris Brickley, my player. And with a big gap mm -hmm. on the scoreboard, the second half begins with very different goals for these teams. One side trying to mount a yeah, comeback, no. one side trying to protect their lead. You look at MP in this one, he's been mm -hmm. ever. of his damage so far has come from the perimeter. A lot of threes early on. He's been vital to spacing the floor for them. Makes everything else you want to do easier to accomplish. Taking a look at the 76ers. They've got MP. Maxi out there with heel. And there's Embiid. And it's Oubre oh, at the small forward position. Blood. When it comes to the essential components of a winning team, GA, how much importance do you place on veteran mm -hmm. leadership? I think it's important. You, you want a few okay. guys in the locker room who've seen it all. Players who can keep the ship steady if the team kind of goes awry or, or has a tough stretch. Now LeBron after the miss three from Tyrese Max. And that one is good. Davis has got the first basket of the second half here for the Lakers. You know, the attention LeBron James demands left his teammate open there, and he found him. The three from MP. Oh, MP sinks the triple. Really? Having a lot of trouble stopping the three-point shot. A little over a minute gone here in the second half. Outside, Davis. Lakers working the ball around now. Six to shoot. Passes it to Reeves. The Lakers need to get a shot off here. With one on the clock and finished off by Anthony Davis. Oh my. See, you can't do that without great athleticism. And that's one thing AD brings to the party. And now it's time to look at our rookie leaderboard and see which of the first-year players are tops in assists during the last month. MV is number one. And he's been setting the table beautifully. I mean, that'll keep his veteran teammates really happy. And for his size and Steve, when healthy, Anthony Davis is as agile and mobile as they come. That's his secret sauce, Kevin. He has great size and skill, but his ability to move like a guard really separates him from other bigs. And the Lakers with possession here after the Sixers pick up two. Here's Davis, and MB pulls it down. And so it's Maxi who brings up the ball for the 76ers. Embiid sets the pick for MP. Oubre outside. The screen. Pulls from the top of the key. It's hauled in by Los Angeles. Well, they've got some work to do to cut into this lead. And no need to get away from the game plan, though. But plenty of time to get back in it. And the latest now from our sideline reporter, David Aldridge. David, it's all yours. Take it away. Thank you, Kevin. For the Sixers, it's championship or bust. Joel Embiid said there's nothing to be happy about just getting to the conference finals or the finals. you got to win the whole thing. That's the goal. And every single day, he's just trying to find ways to make that happen. Back to you. Yep, all or nothing. David, thank you. And here is MP after LeBron James hitting the three. Down low. In close, and B. <laughs> what vision from MP. <laughs> Lakers trail by 13. James in the post. Covered by MP. James, no good. Oubre kicks to MP. <laughs> 139 left to play in the third. <laughs> Just slicing the D to pieces in the pick and roll. MP textbook play. Los Angeles has gone one of two from beyond the arc since coming out of the break. And there's the pass to Hachimura. Screen by Jane. Outside Russell. From outside off the mark. Okay, that's frustrating. You work hard to get these open looks. You know he liked that one back. 
Oubre, a screen on James. MP with it, and Hachimura picks him up defensively. And the leaping ability of Oubre Jr. When he gets inside, this guy is determined to finish. So the Lakers call timeout their first. MP really making a difference here. <laughs> yeah, they're going to have to find a way to run him off his spots out there. He is rolling. Big group substitution here for the Lakers. Vanderbilt's checked in for James. Prince comes in for Hachimura. Reddish, he's checked in for Austin Reed. And Dinwiddie subbed in for Russell. Reed, he's checked in for the 76ers. Harris comes in for Heal. Count that one. Davis has got six points in the quarter. Now that's a high percentage look when the D doesn't fight over the screen. Reason why it takes extra energy to do it. You have to trust your defensive rotations, but it's worth it. MP passes to Reed, and the dunk by Reed. The unselfishness of MP on display there. He's a guy that loves to get his teammates involved. I think it's the Lakers. It be terrible. Then what he is. Um, I was doing three tacos. Survey on the floor. And play stops. Whistle on what looks to be an illegal swing. Beyond the leap. Dinwiddie dishes to James. Pass to Reeves. It's stolen by Heel. Down in the block, it's LeBron and Davis. Then it's Rui Hachimura. And it's Reeves in at the shooting guard position. That's the Laker five. Three. Davis in the corner for three. And Philadelphia grabs the miss. Embiid's got nine rebounds in the game, getting it done. Two minutes remain in the ball. Two minutes. Dinwiddie against MP. Really got Spencer to the goody guard. Dinwiddie with a rebound. Woo, blown opportunity right there. Won't get many chances easier than that one. Here's James. And the Lakers with another miss. And not allowing the shooter even an inch of breathing room on that one. And you know, we always talk about this. Just changing the shot can be just as effective as blocking it, even though it's less spectacular. And one team is just completely outclassing the other tonight. Spirited performance. And it really ignited what is turning out to be a monster win here for the 76ers. You know, it's tough to put your finger on the deciding factor in this one, but I'd say that the shooting accuracy made the difference. Yeah, I think you're on point, Kevin. They got better looks, so that tends to lead to a better field goal percentage. And this will make it 41 victories for them on the year. And with this win, it gives them a sweep of the season series, even though it's just a brief two-game. And you know, looking back at all the contributions tonight, it was a really phenomenal all-around game for MP. And the way he was able to dice up their D with his passing really made things easy for everyone else on his team. Philadelphia moving the ball around. Embiid sets the pick for MP. Offline with his three. And it's Dinwiddie with the ball, bringing it up now for the Lakers. Davis, the pass to Reeves. Now Hachimura. It's Davis on the wing, guarded by Embiid. Four on the clock. Pulls it from 20. Davis with the bucket. This is the thing. You can get up an AD shirt, try to affect the shot, but his size allows him to shoot right over you. MP outside. So it's the 76ers winning this one easily. 